Lawmakers passed new legislation. What makes a human life valuable? To protect a woman's right to an abortion. Maybe it's his contribution to society. Aborted her baby, well, because it had Down syndrome. Her sense of humor. Abortion is a medical procedure. It is not a crime. Maybe he's a scientist or going to write important legislation one day. Abortion rights in New York. Protect a woman's right to choose, particularly at this moment. Or maybe she'll invent the next best thing. Or maybe she'll do all of those things. But I think it's much, much simpler than that. Bailey was born right under three months premature. She spent the first three months in ICU. Her esophagus was not hooked to her trachea. Uh, her intestines were not hooked to her stomach wall. So at negative three months, less than three pounds, she's going under five hours of anesthetic for surgery. As Bailey was coming out of surgery, she had taken her oxygen mask off on her own, and I knew at that time that she was going to be the force to be reckoned with, which she is. The Down syndrome didn't scare me. The fact that my child may not live was scary. But I had strong faith in God. He had put a picture in my, my brain of what Bailey would look like at kindergarten. And it was this little dark-skinned, long-haired, sassy with a big bow, with attitude walking into kindergarten. And it was weird the day that she did. It was exactly the vision I'd been given. We want Bailey to dream. We want her to excel. We want her to experiment. We want her to keep pushing herself. I want Bailey to have those same opportunities that everybody else has. And I just want her to be able to seize the moment and be able to capitalize on everything that comes along her way. A lot of just letting go and just trusting the Lord is going to take care of her. And she's just skyrocketed to what she can do in life. For somebody that may not know a lot about the special needs community, you know, they don't know how to act, what would you tell them? Uh, I say, let's come up, let's just greet people and treat us the way you won't be treated. Well, Bailey, everyone deserves a night to feel special, a night to remember that they're loved. A night to shine. Which is exactly the goal of the Tim Tebow Foundation. I heard some of you guys are going to Night to Shine tonight, correct? Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Are you excited about it? Yeah. Awesome. Well, do you know why we host Night to Shine? Why? Because we love you. Thank you oh. so much. We love you guys. And, yeah. you know, when we named it Night to Shine, we did it because we believe that um, on a night like tonight, there's a lot of things that shine. And number one is you guys, that you get a night where you can shine. It's a night where all the volunteers can shine, but maybe most importantly, it's a night where God gets to shine. Is that pretty cool? Yes. We hope that you really enjoy it um, because it's all about you. It's a prom event held at churches all around the world for one night to remind the special needs community that they are cherished, that God loves them, and we love them just the way they are. People with special needs um, need to know that they're accepted. They need to know that they're loved. To see them laugh, to see them smile, it is so special. What do you think Night to Shine does for the special needs community? Like, how does it help them grow and feel? All you need to do is watch it. The minute they come and walk up that red carpet, it's amazing. How you doing? What on? <laughs> Every single one of them, it's, it's like an event they've never experienced before, and it's like an event that they look forward to. 
They are waiting for this day for months in advance, and they don't forget it. That's a neat thing. They never forget this, this, this event. Every year, they talk about it way in advance of it ever happening. You know, I, I just think about everybody has a gift, and I think people struggle trying to find their gift. What do you do special? And uh, I look at Bailey, when she goes into her room and meets people, it, the, it just, everyone, it just lights up the whole room. And I wish I had that gift. I, just, I don't have it. <laughs> she has it. And, uh, and I, I think all these special needs, uh, young adults, kids, everybody has something. And, you know, trying to pull it out of them or find it may be difficult sometimes, but it's there. And uh, we just need to give them a chance to find it. And uh, every time I go to this event, I, I find, I look out and I'll find that one or two people that, oh my gosh, they're special. They're really doing something special. And uh, we just need to open our eyes and really pay attention. Because tonight is all about you. The red carpets, the celebrations, the applause, it's all for you. It's because we love you, it's because you matter, and it is because you are so special. And you know why the red carpet, why, oh, why 656 Night to Shines around the world have red carpets is because it signifies something. It signifies worth. It signifies significance. It signifies meaning. So when you walk down a red carpet in our society, it means you're somebody. And why we stand there and clap for you is because you are somebody. I think if you watch TV very long at all right now, you're gonna think that everything going on in America is arguing and fighting. But when you see what God does through the people all over our communities through Night to Shine, you see so much more. Without any further ado, to crown every single one of you as the king or the queen of the prom. It's because we believe that's how the God of this universe sees you every day of your life. God does not make mistakes. And so every individual is made in God's image. Uh, to see these individuals and to get to know them. Um, you can't imagine the world. We cannot th imagine the world without Bailey. It just give them a chance, get to know them. I mean, they're, they're, they're more like you than you think they are. Same as you and I. I mean, they're, they're individuals that uh, will probably give more to your life than you can ever imagine. So, what makes life valuable? I think it's pretty simple. All life is valuable because all life has the capacity to bring service, joy, and love to the rest of humanity.